Breast cancer affects millions of people every year, and still, people are not much aware of it. Many people ignore early symptoms, which results in severe conditions. Today, we will discuss 10 breast cancer signs that you should never ignore. Number one, nipple retraction. One of the major changes your breast experiences during breast cancer is a change in the nipples, like nipple retraction. Nipple retraction is when the nipple turns inward instead of pointing outward. This happens to one or both nipples. It can be due to multiple reasons, such as breast infection, injury, and non-cancerous tumors. But it is also an alarming symptom of breast cancer, especially if it develops suddenly. If you're thinking about the cause of it, well, it occurs due to different reasons. One of the main reasons is tumor growth. When a tumor develops in the breast, it changes the structure of the breast tissue, causing visible changes. Specifically, when a tumor grows beneath or near the nipple, it pulls the surrounding tissue inward. As the tumor increases in size, it puts more pressure on the tissue, leading to nipple retraction or inversion. Besides, cancerous tumors change the elasticity and structural integrity of the breast tissue, making it more open to these changes. Also, fibrosis, which is scar tissue formation, is another major factor. Breast cancer also leads to the development of scar tissues which contract over time and pull the nipple inward. Number two, skin texture changes. Changes in skin texture, especially on the breast, also indicate breast cancer. One major change is skin dimpling, which gives the skin a texture similar to an orange peel. This happens when the breast skin becomes thick and dimpled, similar to the surface of an orange. It is caused by fluid buildup in the breast due to blocked lymph vessels, mostly due to cancer cells blocking the lymphatic system. It is normally linked with inflammatory breast cancer, IBC, a rare and aggressive form of the disease. In IBC, cancer cells block the lymph vessels of the breast skin, causing a dimpled appearance. Unlike other types of breast cancer, IBC mostly does not form a clear lump. Instead, skin changes like dimpling are important symptoms to recognize. Other skin texture changes, such as puckering or thickening, also occur. These changes are subtle at first, but become more prominent over time. It's important to know that skin texture changes indicate breast cancer, but they can also be from other less serious issues like skin infections or injuries. Still, any unexpected changes in how the breast skin feels or looks should be checked by a doctor. Number three, unusual discharge. Have you ever experienced unusual discharge from your nipples? If yes, then it is not a good sign, especially when it occurs without stimulation, such as breastfeeding or squeezing the nipple. Normal nipple discharge occurs in women, especially during pregnancy, breastfeeding, or sometimes during the menstrual cycle. This discharge is normally clear, milky, or yellowish, and is not a cause for concern. But unusual discharge that is persistent occurs without stimulation, is bloody, or occurs in only one breast is a sign of a more serious condition, such as breast cancer. Cancerous tumors in the breast directly affect the normal functioning of the milk ducts, which leads to nipple discharge. These tumors exert pressure on the ducts or cause structural changes that result in abnormal fluid secretion. Besides these, cancer cells also cause inflammation in the breast. This disturbs the normal ductal system, which leads to unusual discharge. Also, the amount of discharge a breast produces depends on the type of cancer. For example, hormone receptor positive breast cancer influences the quantity of nipple discharge. The discharge is accompanied by other symptoms such as a lump, skin changes, or nipple inversion. Number four, swelling in the armpit or collarbone. The next concerning symptom on our list is swelling in the armpit or collarbone area. Breast cancer normally spreads to nearby lymph nodes which are small, bean-shaped structures part of the body's immune system. When cancer cells travel to these lymph nodes, they cause them to swell. The lymph nodes in the armpit and collarbone are common sites for breast cancer metastasis, leading to swelling in these areas. But the question is, when the tumor is in the breast, why swelling is occurring in nearby areas? It's because cancerous breast tumors also block the lymphatic vessels, which are responsible for draining fluid from tissues throughout the body. This obstruction blockage leads to lymph fluid buildup, causing swelling in nearby lymph nodes and tissues, including those in the armpit and collarbone. This swelling is observable as a lump or mass that feels different from the surrounding tissue. It varies in size and sometimes causes tenderness when touched. Swollen lymph nodes in the armpit or collarbone area are the first signs that breast cancer has spread beyond the breast tissue. Swelling varies from mild to severe, and some people also notice their armpits or collarbones feeling fuller. Sometimes, the skin over swollen areas looks red or inflamed. 
especially with an infection. Number five, persistent pain. Persistent breast or chest pain is also a sign of breast cancer, but it is not as common as lumps or skin changes. The type of pain depends on different factors, such as the cancer stage, the location of the tumor, and the person's sensitivity to pain. The common type of pain reported by many women with breast cancer is dull aches or soreness. It feels like a persistent dull ache or soreness in the breast or armpit area. This pain is normally caused by the tumor pressing on nearby tissues or nerves. Some women experience sharp stabbing pain in the breast or chest area. This pain is irregular and more noticeable when moving or touching the breast. Others may feel a burning or tingling sensation in the breast or nipple, usually accompanied by redness or inflammation in the affected area. The pain normally indicates the growth of the tumor. As the tumor enlarges, it exerts pressure on nerves, tissues, and organs, leading to discomfort and pain. Number six, redness and warmth. If you feel warmth in your breast or observe any redness, do not ignore it, as these can be significant symptoms of breast cancer. Women normally overlook it as an infection or mastitis, especially when they are breastfeeding, but it is not something you should ignore. Also, sometimes this warmth and redness are accompanied by itching and red lumps indicating that something is unwell. Well, what's the reason behind it? This happens mostly in inflammation breast cancer. In IBC, cancer cells block the lymphatic vessels in the skin of the breast, leading to an inflammatory appearance without an actual infection. This blockage results in redness, warmth, and swelling of the breast, making the skin look thick and pitted. Another cause is the tumor growth itself, which needs an increased blood supply. As tumors grow, they stimulate the formation of new blood vessels. This process is known as angiogenesis, which increases the blood flow to the area and causes redness and warmth. Also, when breast cancer attacks the skin, it causes visible changes such as redness, swelling, and warmth, mostly associated with more advanced stages of the disease. Number seven, changes in breast size and shape. Being a woman, we need to check on unusual changes in our breasts, whether it's a change in size, color, shape, or anything, even though it could be due to infection, hormonal change, or any other non-cancerous condition, it is also an alarming sign of breast cancer. Well, it is common for women to have slightly different sized breasts, but a sudden noticeable change in breast size or shape between the two breasts is a sign of breast cancer. This change indicates a tumor growing in one breast, causing it to swell or deform in shape. There are two different cases. Some women experience one breast becoming larger or swollen compared to the other. This swelling is caused by the tumor blocking lymphatic vessels in the breast, leading to a buildup of fluid. In some cases, breast cancer causes one breast to shrink or become noticeably smaller than the other. This occurs if the tumor pulls on the surrounding tissue, causing the breast to retract or appear smaller. Besides changes in size, breast cancer also changes the contour and shape of the breast. This appears as a visible bulge or indentation in the breast tissue. As a tumor grows, it also changes the position of the breast tissue causing the breast to appear higher or lower on the chest wall than usual. Number eight, fatigue and weakness. We all feel tired and drained from time to time. Sometimes it is because of a hectic day or incomplete sleep, but constant fatigue and never ending tiredness are not a good sign. It also indicates many serious issues like breast cancer. How? Let's get into this. As cancer cells grow and divide rapidly, they consume a lot of the body's energy and nutrients. This competition for resources leaves normal cells, including those responsible for energy production, depleted, leading to fatigue. Do you know some cancers lead to anemia, a condition characterized by a low red blood cell count? Red blood cells carry oxygen to tissues throughout the body. When there are not enough red blood cells, the body's tissues and organs, including muscles and the brain, do not receive an adequate oxygen supply, leading to fatigue. Also, Cancer cells produce waste products as they grow and multiply. These byproducts are toxic to the body and contribute to feelings of fatigue and malaise. Fatigue can occur at any stage of breast cancer treatment, from diagnosis through survivorship. It may begin before treatment starts, worsen during treatment, and continue after treatment ends. Managing fatigue is an important part of breast cancer care. Strategies such as energy conservation, regular, moderate exercise, Balanced nutrition and good sleep hygiene can help reduce fatigue. Number nine, unexplained weight loss. Weight changes are something we never take into consideration. It's okay if it is about two to three kilos, but a huge sudden weight loss is concerning. Can you believe 
This also indicates breast cancer. Yes, sudden weight loss is this much serious. Breast cancer causes weight loss through complex mechanisms affecting the body's metabolism, appetite regulation, and nutrient absorption. Cancer cells affect the body's metabolic processes, leading to increased energy expenditure and breakdown of muscle and fat tissues. Besides, cancer triggers systemic inflammation, which further increases metabolic demand and can reduce appetite. This decreased appetite and more energy utilization causes weight loss. Besides, some types of breast cancer also affect the gastrointestinal tract, decreasing the absorption of nutrients from food. This causes malnutrition and weight loss, even if a person consumes a proper amount of food. Number 10. Ulceration or sores. Another major symptom you should not ignore is ulcers or sores in the breast. For your better understanding, an ulcer is an open sore or wound that develops on the skin's surface. It starts as a small, shallow lesion and slowly progresses into a deeper, crater-like sore. Ulcers vary in size and shape and are surrounded by inflamed or discolored skin. Ulcers also sometimes ooze fluid or pus and hurt when touched. They show up anywhere on your body, including your breasts. Sores are also similar to ulcers, but refer to a broader range of skin abnormalities, including cuts, scrapes, blisters, or lesions. Like ulcers, sores vary in size, shape, and appearance, and might be accompanied by symptoms such as pain, itching, or tenderness. It occurs because as breast cancer advances, tumors grow larger and attack surrounding tissues, including the skin. Cancer cells break through the skin's surface and create open wounds or ulcers. Recognizing these overlooked signs of breast cancer could save your life or the life of someone you love. Remember, the earlier breast cancer is detected, the better the chances of successful treatment. If you notice any of these signs, please consult your doctor immediately. If you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also, subscribe to our channel to see more videos. Until then, stay hydrated and stay healthy.